hello everyone welcome to my channel in this video i will be showing you step by step on how to make authentic mandazi mandazi are very delicious and they are very easy to prepare and for this you will need flour milk salt cardamom egg yeast baking powder minted margarine and sugar and in a large bowl i will combine the dry ingredient first add in the sugar cardamom yeast baking powder and salt and i will miss all the dry ingredients very well till everything is well combined next in another bowl i will miss the wet ingredients i'll add in the egg and milk I will save the rest of the milk for later use, my minted margarine, and I will miss. And that is done. I will create a well and add in the wet ingredients. I will use my wooden spoon to mix till everything comes together. I will add in more milk. So for the liquid, you will have to add it gradually till you get the consistency you are looking for. So I'm going to be working with my hands right now. And my hands are clean. So I will use my hands to mix it very well till everything comes together. Next, I will transfer into a clean surface and I'm going to be kneading this for about 10 to 15 minutes. Now add in some more flour. Because it's getting sticky so I'm adding a little bit of flour and I will keep kneading so now I've been kneading it for about 10 minutes and it's smooth And I will transfer into a bowl I will cover with kitchen napkin and leave it to rise for about an hour so this is an hour later the dough has doubled in size I'm gonna need for just a minute I will divide it to the sizes I'm going to be working with.
next I'm going to roll them out So for Madazi, you don't want it to be too thin. So I'm going to be using a cycle to cut, cycle cutter to cut the Madazi because I want to, I'm trying to create a cycle, a round shape here. And I will use the knife to divide the round, the round dough into four parts. So this is the shape I'm going for. You can cut any shape of your choice. So that knife wasn't doing good job. So I, I, I just changed my knife. And for Madazi dough, you can freeze the dough and use it anytime you want to. I'm going to repeat the process till I'm done. And I want to say a big thank you to my new and my old subscribers. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel already, please subscribe. Put on the notification bell so you get notified each time I upload video. So once I'm done cutting, I'm going to go ahead to start frying them right away. They don't need to rise again. And here I have the oil on the stove already and the oil is hot. I'm going to be frying on medium heat. So I'm going to keep um, um, flipping, flipping it. So for Mandazi, once you put them in the oil, they will start to rise. So once they are golden brown, I will take them out of the oil. And you can have madazi any time of the day. You can have them for breakfast, for snack. They are super, super delicious. And they are ready. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Remain blessed and I will see you in my next video.